what is up you guys welcome back to my channel my name is Jason and before anything make sure you guys are subscribed hit the like button and leave a comment on the video and just tell me about what you guys think about it it really helps me a lot suggest anything if you guys want that also really helps and let's get on with what we're doing today so today we're actually gonna dive into my notebook where I compile all of my my in writing where I practice where I like to just write basically and in this writing specifically and let's get started this first page here are just some random sentences i've written down it's really nothing uh, it's really noticeable that i really didn't have control with the pen and it usually bled a lot on me it's very blotchy at some spots and this was really where I've I started to become pretty pretty knowledgeable on the writing and how to do it and what forms what basic forms are kind of required to to write the system. Here's more writing, just random things I I've chosen to to write down. I really wanted to just improve. That's why I practiced in this journal. Up here, I actually put in a Maya date right there in the corner. I can't read it because I still haven't really learned the names for each of the months in Maya. There's some more Maya writing right there. And here I chose to write it in pencil and see how that would go. I didn't really like it because I kind of like uh, to have my writing pretty nice looking in the journal since I'm going to have it here anyway, but uh, yeah, there's that. Here's some ways that I chose to write those. More glyphs like that, just practicing, you know, writing random things, some introductions of myself. Yeah. That's that page. Here's more Maya writing. I really didn't fill this page up because I don't know. I don't like left sides a lot. <laughs> and yeah, there's some Maya writing. And over here on this page, I got some more Maya writing. I just kind of doodled sparkles on some of them. There, see? Right there. There was still a lot of things I was getting wrong in these couple of pages. Since I was still in the process of researching on the conventions, basically. These are all sentences or phrases that I've written down. Right there. That's some more Maya writing. I actually really started to like how I was writing in these few pages. It started to really become a certain shape most of the time. You could write it vertically, horizontally, and it's a really cool way to write. It's very East Asian though, but you know, it's not, it's Native American. There's another date. There's some more stuff I wrote down. Very neat. More stuff. Right there. I really don't like um, when I skip lines because I just feel like it's a waste of space when you add it up. So I like mixing up like vertical and horizontal writing so I can take advantage of the page. Here's more of my writing over there. Here I just started practicing uh, the skeleton structures of like the individual syllables in this page. Next page. Here's more Maya writing. I I did start to become a bit more, well, 
Hmm, how could I say it? I started to become a little bit more quicker in writing this. I wanted to find the more like, how could I say it? Like more simplified versions of, of the glyphs. So it could be like written like on the day-to-day -day basis, you know? Most of the sources they give out there, they're pretty complicated, I think. I know because each one takes a really long time to do and it's really not conventional if it's gonna be written in like a day-to-day -day life. Those were actually made a bit more complex because you know, if you're gonna have it on, on rock carved in for a while, why not make it look nice? That's what I think. That's what I think happened. That's why a lot of them are pretty complex looking. But on vases I found, there's a lot of easier ways to write some of these glyphs. And I don't know why that isn't really given. Here's some more. See, I don't know if you guys can see like these bubble versions, but like the details not in them. I just chose to practice the, the outer line basically without the details inside. Right there, more my writing. Here's more bubbles. I like to call them bubbles when <laughs> there's no details in them because that's how they literally look like. Here's that page. And here's more stuff. Right there. And I've actually memorized like literally everything. I don't have anything from, I don't really use uh, any other sources than my head now. I pretty much memorized a lot of logograms, which are symbols that mean words or ideas and syllablograms that are just syllables. I've learned that. The whole syllabary, basically. I'm just always researching for new versions of things. If, if there's new variants found or anything like that, so I could use them. And yeah, that's pretty much it right here. It kind of ends. And let me know if you guys want me to make a video of just like writing, writing random sentences just to see how like it's written. Right there. I really, I really like writing this a lot. It's a hobby basically now, but I want to really try to bring it back as a, a standardized writing so it can be written and known by a lot of people. That's why I'm kind of sharing it on YouTube because a lot of, there's not a lot of YouTube videos on this and if there is, it's kind of, it's kind of complex unnecessarily and kind of just sharing this to to spread the word that it is a learnable writing system it is something that can be learned and something that can be used on the day-to-day -day basis not just not just for that quick doodle in the corner of your worksheet or something like that it can actually be used yeah, and that's pretty much it. It's just one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven and a half pages I've kind of completed of this, of this journal. What is my comb doing there? Sorry. <laughs> and yeah, I think that's pretty much it. If you guys, Want me to to show you guys this journal after it's completed and see my progress? Definitely hit the like button, hit the bell too if you guys would like to see more of my videos. I am definitely gonna be posting on on this Mayan stuff because I know there's a lot of people out there who would like to learn it or would just like to know more about it, you know? And yeah, that's pretty much it you guys. Make sure you guys hit the like button, subscribe, and press the notification bell so you guys never miss my videos when I post, and I'll see you guys later. Bye!